No? So you... Okay. Good? Yeah. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and happy Christmas to you all. Uh, welcome to the Friday Gear Show. We're coming at you live from Chamonix, and, well, there's a reason that we're coming at you live today. Terry, what's going on? Oh, Christmas presents. And since Christmas is, what, two weeks away? You don't really have enough time. Well, there's not that much time to, well, order Christmas presents and stuff like that. And if you are not sure yet of what to get for your climbing partner or for yourself, uh, we have a couple of ideas for you. Yeah, because climbers are like, they love gear, right? They hoard yeah. gear. And if you're buying a present for a climber, it can be tricky because they seem to have everything already. Mm. Um, so what we've done is we've split uh, Christmas gifts into certain categories. So we've got indoor climbing, below 50 euros, intermediate climber and expert climber. So hopefully you can find your niche, your present niche, and pick the right gift for the climber you're buying for. because. Around about the 17th, right? That's the last time they have to order. 17th of December. You can order after that, but then it's not really guaranteed if you're gonna get it on time or not. And it is Christmas time. There are a lot of packages going around. So, you know, to be on time for Christmas day, yeah, order before the 17th of December. Yeah, and express mm. delivery is important um, yeah. because express delivery is an option on the Epic TV shop. You click on that, it goes super speedy because as Terry said, it's a busy time of year and you want to guarantee those presents. So if I was you, because I'm especially paranoid, uh, if I was buying a gift right now, I would order express delivery because I don't want my present to get lost. That's that's what I'd do. Maybe, you, maybe it's too much. Have you got any Christmas presents yet? <laughs> I've done, I've literally done nothing. Hey. I know what my mum wants, but she told me exactly what she wants. Uh, that's good. Yeah, so that's okay. But um, yeah, in terms of anyone else, nothing. <laughs> you? Um, I mean, I thought about it and uh, gave a lot of love and, uh, and thoughts to those <laughs> presents, but uh, no, not, not, yet. not yet. Right, shall we crack on? Um, and I think we're going to start with indoor climbing as a category. Okay. So if the climber in your life you're buying a present for is sort of very into gyms, climbing walls, training inside, this is the category for you. Uh, let me just switch it over on here so we can see the products that I'm talking about at the same time. Hopefully that's working for you now. Um, Hugo in the background will let us know. And hello to everyone commenting as well. Nice to see you. If you're here for the giveaway, that's coming at the end Ooh, of right. the show-ish. Maybe halfway through the show. Uh, yes, we'll mention a couple of times. Now the first thing I want to talk about is what's on screen now, which is the Momentum Vegan Climbing Shoe from Black Diamond. Mm. Now this is a beginner's shoe, or a, maybe a more of a sort of intermediate beginner's shoe. Is it on screen? It should be on screen, yeah, I've got it on my thing. Um, we good? Yep. Yes. Um, so this is a sort of beginner to intermediate shoe, okay. or someone who's looking to climb indoors a, a lot. So you want a comfy shoe, lots of support, uh, that is durable as well, mm -hmm. so you'll know how like hard plastic holds are. Yeah. Momentum, 75 euros-ish on the Epic TV shop, so it's a reasonable price. It's made of one single piece of rubber on the bottom, so mm -hmm. that creates that stiffness, that support you're looking for. And as a bonus, it's vegan. So uh, if you're a vegan, uh, or you care about vegan issues, ideology, ideas, uh, then uh, you can get a vegan pair of climbing shoes. Great bargain. Uh, and great color. Yeah, I quite like it, that understated gray. I'll zoom it up because um, it's kind of, it's different, isn't it? It's yeah. not like a normal climbing shoe color. No, it's nice and stylish. And about stylish things, mm. my pick is a snap bouldering bucket. There, there you go. Um, yeah, I just think, I don't know, you need a dedicated bouldering bucket if you boulder at a climbing gym because I usually just bring my normal chalk bag mm -hmm. but then you don't have space for your phone your keys brushes um and this is a nice zip up can you show it yeah sorry there you go. <laughs> it has a nice zip up uh pouch that you can just put all those things in it and it's made of recycled the uh, recycled polyester so yeah. I'm flipping I the mean, colors on screen yeah. lots of different colors as well I don't know, Snap is so uh, snappy and colorful and um, just, I don't know, like stylish. Yeah, I think you're right. It's the style thing, isn't it? That yeah. big blocky writing, that mm. two-tone design, mm -hmm. it's going to make you stand out. Um, a few people are saying that they like that they have the momentum yeah. climbing shoes. Uh, people are saying, where's everyone from? Where are you watching us from? Let us know uh, where in the world you're watching us. And especially if it's a weird time of day or you're in a weird place, then please let us know. If you're having like 3 a.m. cookies. Where's 3 a.m. though? Australia? Is that you? Let us know in the comments, <laughs> on the live comments. We're going to do one more category and then we're going to give away this uh, tickets to the movie. Mm -hmm. 
But what we're going to move on to is gifts under 50 euros. Okay. Because let's be honest, Christmas is an expensive time. There's a lot yes. to buy. So sometimes you just need something a little bit cheaper, uh, perhaps as a stocking filler, mm -hmm. or perhaps you've got other presents, however you want to play it. Now, I should say that uh, to support this show, we've got an article yes. on the show and carousel pages. Yes. So the article has, well, all of this, most of these uh, products in it, and the carousel pages is just... Uh, all these categories, categories we're gonna talk about today, uh, but more products. Yeah, and if you scroll down the description, all the category pages are linked, link. so you can just click on the one we're talking about. We're only taking a selection out of that, there's loads of different ones on it. Um, right, the giveaway. <laughs> we, yeah, yeah, so we're doing the giveaway after this one, after this category we're giving away the, well, the movie joining, so it's just good to Oh, okay, cool. Okay. Hello, hello everyone. From Hong Kong, uh, Australia, Florida. Ooh, hi. Well, that's US. Hi, US. <laughs> um, no, but I bought the giveaway. Uh, yeah, it's for tomorrow. There's Tomorrow there's like a movie, an online movie night, and we have 10 tickets to give away. So that's coming up at the end of the show. We'll tell you how to actually win the tickets. And it's, uh, it's to Valhalla, right? Valhalla, which apparently is a Viking thing. Yeah, it's like, I don't know what it is. Which god is Valhalla? No, no isn't idea. it when you like... Pass away and like you, oh, go, you go to Valhalla. To Valhalla. That's isn't true. It? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't That's know. It's a video true. game as well. But there you go. You're under fifty. <laughs> uh, I think you're up first. The Am Ash. I up first? Oh yes. Okay. So my pick, which you can uh, yep, funny, see on funny. screen right now, um, is the Hash Portable Hangboard, and it's sort of a training warm-up tool. It's a bit of a hybrid. Uh, it's small. It's just forty meter, forty meters wide. 40 centimeters long, so it fits in most back backpacks and luggages if you're traveling around. Um, and yeah, it's just a um, nice little warm-up tool. It has three pockets and I guess the big edge, you can use it as a big pull-up edge. And the pockets on the hard side is 15 millimeters deep, like the small ones. And then there's the big pocket in the middle at two millimeters. No, two, two million, two mi 20, 20, do, milli 20 millimeters in the middle. 20 millimeters in the middle, so that's a deep one. And then 15 millimeters in the, on the outside. Yeah. But that's the hard side. And then you flip it over to the easy side, it's all 20 milliliters. Mm -hmm. Milliliters? Millimeters. Can I speak? <laughs> She's talking about depth, so that's how deep the pockets are. Um, and what's cool about this is it's not just a training tool, because you can, as you said, take it to the crowd, yeah. warm up. Warm up, warm up with it. Because um, it's freezing at the moment, isn't it? Yes, and it's 49 euros. So for a training portable hanging thing, uh, it, has, it has quite a good price. I think it's very reasonable, handmade, beautiful, all the rest. Um, so that's your under 50 euros. And yes, if, if 49. I got, if I got a hangboard in my stocking, I'd be well chuffed. How cool well would that be? Well chuffed. Well um, So my under 20 euro present is a bit of a weird one. It's different. It's on screen. It's font top trumps. Okay. Uh, now, to uh, how do top trumps ask uh, work? Well, basically, it, it's a versus versus situation. So with the font top trumps, there are various different boulder problems and they're rated on different things. So for example, I'm just reading this off here. There is uh, height, grade, sandbag, aesthetics. So you pick the one you think can beat your opposition. You challenge them to it and whoever wins gets that card. So if you're a font fan, uh, and who isn't, frankly. Uh, if you love font and you really want to get ultra involved in font, this is the card game for you. And it's only 16 euros-ish, 15.44, on the Epic TV shop. Do you get more points if you actually have done the bowlers? I think you should, right? Like, definitely should. Or at least, do you remember those? Um, did you ever have them in Switzerland? Those, like, bird-watching books where you ticked off on the book. I can't remember who made them, like Penguin or something? Anyway, okay. uh, I think it should be like that. It should be a little tick box on the card so you can be like, yep. Sent. Done it. Mm. Um, <laughs> uh, no, I didn't have bird watching books. Maybe I missed out on my childhood. I don't know. You definitely did. You definitely did. I love that. Um, are we going to say hi to people? Yeah, let's have a quick shout out. So, loads of people from all over the world. We've got to shout where you're coming from Netherlands, Korea. That's awesome. Uh, Hoi, Dublin. I don't know what the other one oh. Joshua Tree. Uh, oh, and a lot of people talking about Viking Valhalla, uh, which is, yeah, where Vikings came from. Apparently. Oh, came from. Mm. Uh, mm. No, where Vikings go. Yeah, so the heaven. Uh, and why are we talking about Valhalla? Because tomorrow night, uh, there's the online Helsinki Adventure movie night, and they're going to show two movies, Valhalla and the new Lynn Hill movie, and we've got 10 tickets to give away. 
So a special giveaway at the end of the episode. Yeah, and if you want to win those tickets, we were talking about this earlier. Mm. I think we're on room names for this. Oh, did we decide? Let's go with that. So here's how you win those 10 tickets. Now, it's important you listen because you can mess this up. Do not comment in the live chat section of this because we can't find you afterwards. What you need to do is comment below the episode in the normal comments. And what will you, well, what we want you to say is, the film Valhalla, it's all about Eddie Moran, Eddie Mar Mar Moran, Mar 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 Edu Moran, Edu Moran, Moran, <laughs> him. Sorry. He's setting up uh, a new route, I can't speak today. He's setting up a new route in China. So what we wanted to know is, what is your route name? If you put up a first ascent, what would you call it? Uh, best one, after the show or midway through the show, whenever we decide, they're gonna win. So comment below this live stream, not on the live comments. What's your route name? Good question. Um, I know mine. I don't know. I'd always think like, like some kind of like, you know, I love crimps. So like if I had crimped to do away. a crimped away, yeah, that's good. If I did, did a first ascent, it would involve crimps. Right. Um, so yeah, something to do with crimps or small edges, edgy. I don't know. What would yours be? <laughs> a punny one, apparently. <laughs> a punny one, exactly. Uh, mine would be uh, Nutella cookies. Uh, biscotti alla Nutella. Oh, right. Anyway, you know the Nutella filled cookies. I have I experienced them the other day. Yeah, incredible. Yeah, yeah, and I think you know they're like, I don't know, they're the perfect crack snacks and and everything. So, so you think not? your route would be so good that it would be as good as Nutella cookies? Uh, yeah, I, I definitely wouldn't waste that name on any other not good route. <laughs> There we go. Uh, so comment beneath the episode uh, with your um, with your root names. Um, but about the movie night, actually, if you want to get the tickets in case you won't win one or you just really want to see those two movies, you can go on the website that's linked down below and there is a discount code of EPIC20 and you get 20% off the tickets. EPIC TV 20. EPIC TV 20. <laughs> But Thanks, yeah. Hugo. So if you don't get lucky in winning one, we're still giving you a discount. This is Christmas, time to give. Talking about giving, we're halfway through this show. Uh, if you're just joining us, welcome. We're chatting about Climber's Christmas presents. So if you're stuck for an idea or you need a little suggestion, we've got a whole bunch of different ideas for you to make this whole process simple. And we're moving on to intermediate climbing. So an intermediate climber, are you an intermediate climber? <laughs> I think I'm always an intermediate. I don't think I do as intermediate. I think like, I, no, it, <laughs> progression, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's like the climber that already like has, has been climbing for a while and you probably have most of the gear already, mm -hmm. uh, but you're looking for that little upgrade uh, to train harder or um, just to have in your life. Yeah, well, I think the training thing is important because I think when you're a beginner, all you want to do is climb, right? You're just yeah. getting used to it. When you step up to that intermediate level, you're like, ooh, that route that I couldn't do, that might be possible now. And then suddenly training starts to become important, mm -hmm. which is why we picked this next gift, which is the Cafe Craft Give Me Craft book, which is up on screen now. Uh, bright green, as you can see. Oh, a few people are saying the comment box isn't active. Uh, right, that's a good, good point. It we will try will to uh, tweak that <laughs> so you can actually enter this competition. Uh, it will be at the end of, like, when we undo it live. When we finish the live show, it will be active, so you can comment then. Exactly, we, don't worry. So we'll either try to sort it out now, uh, or we'll do it at the end of the show. But get your ideas sorted in your head, and then you can be good. But thank you for letting us know, that's a good, very good point. Uh, right, so the Gimme Craft book. Uh, what this, it was just disappeared from my screen. There you go. So this is a training book. Now, if you know anything about um, Cafe Craft, it's this legendary climbing wall in Germany, near Nuremberg, near the Frankenjura. People like Wolfgang Gulick, he climbed there, or climbed was associated with that. We've got Alex Magus, he climbs there. His trainers, Dicky Korb, he's there as well. So it's this sort of training hub. Mm -hmm. And those guys have come up with various training products, and one of them is this book. Uh, just over 30 euros. Comes with a book, so you can go through all the different training techniques, the plans, how to do it, uh, the right exercises you need. And as a bonus, it's got a DVD with it so that you can put it in and you can actually watch the exercises. Because oh. you know when you read an exercise, you're like, okay, a pull-up, cool. Sure. And then you see someone doing a pull-up and you're like, oh, I see, so like shoulder blade back, you know, there's lots of mm -hmm. things. So you can watch the technique on the DVD video okay. to support the book. Bargain. Uh, yeah, but I think this is for an intermediate climber, but then, you know, if they follow it, they can climb 9C like Alex. 
There you go. If you buy this book, you'll climb 9C. And if you can't, write to Teresa personally All right. and request the refund immediately. <laughs> it might take a couple of years. <laughs> Big disclaimer. Uh, what's my present? Ooh, trousers. Uh, um, can you change it, please? Yes, please? sorry. <laughs> Thanks. Um, yeah, so as an intermediate climber, okay, again, as a beginner climber, you just go to the gym and wear whatever you have. Mm. You know, PJs, leggings, what other type of trousers? Shorts, but that's bad for the knees. Um, but when you like are an intermediate climber, um, I think you also just want a nice pair of jeans that you can go from the office to the gym to or from school to the gym. And the black diamond forged denim pants are pretty sweet because first of all, they look like normal jeans, which is a big plus. Cause you know, cause sometimes like climbing clothes can be a bit Geeky. baggy, yeah. <laughs> baggy, wrong colors, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, these have a really good selection of colors, um, like classical blue color and then like a nice black jeans. And they're pretty amazing because they're super stretchy, but again, look like normal jeans, have pockets for all the girls that are wondering, they have pockets. Um, and yeah, I just think it's an awesome present for somebody, but if you don't want to start guessing sizes for your friends, um, just get one yourself. Cause, uh, I mean, you won't, you'll be pleased with this present. Yeah, you definitely will be. I mean, I've worn them uh, oh, last right. year. I had them yeah. uh, just, okay. So like all climbing trousers, I go through the bum, the knees, the crotch, right? Almost, almost immediately. Uh, these <laughs> pretty much survived the entire year of hard climbing. Uh, and what you said, I love the fact that I could pull it on, go to, so let's say I was doing a climbing daily shoot, right? Mm. So we do the shooting on camera and then I maybe climb afterwards in the gym and I could do all those things at the same time with one pair of jeans, which yeah. is awesome. Well, the nice thing about them is that I guess you can wear them during the day and they're like one color and then you go to the gym and chalk them up a bit. <laughs> yeah, different color at that point. Changes yeah. color. <laughs> right, we're almost done. We've got one more category to go through, but do remember that prize. So comment the beneath the video, the giveaway, sorry. Comment beneath the video when you can uh, about your root name. So if you did a first ascent, what would you call your root name? We've got 10 free tickets to give away for the Valhalla movie, which is uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow night, yes. Yeah. Right, last category, expert climbers. So what do you buy the climber who's got it all? Because, I mean, I've got a big old gear cupboard full of stuff. Your gear cupboard is quite big. Uh, it, it can be tricky because climbers usually have a lot of stuff mm. if they're at that level. So we try to think creatively here uh, and head torches what we thought of straight away. Yeah, so again, an expert climber probably already has a head torch. So you're looking for like a little upgrade. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm not saying I'm, a, I'm an expert climber, but I did upgrade my head torch game with the uh, Petzl EcoCore. Cause I used to have the Bindi, which is great. It's like super tiny, rechargeable head torch. Uh, and this is as well. You can recharge it via USB plug and uh, but it, then if you can don't have anywhere to charge it you can swap the batteries around um so yeah ultralight we actually did a gear review about it so i'm trying to like remember well it's that's from that day it's about the headband isn't it because that thing is new it's not like the normal yeah. floppy band we i see. mean you do look again geeky and uh, like uh i don't know like you came out of a space shuttle type thing um but it is super comfortable on your head and it just doesn't budge you can go running climbing i don't know what else do you do in it well, skiing yeah um, skiing and it just won't budge and again it's great on alpine climbs uh because it fits on your helmet or um afterwards when you're not wearing a helmet and again it stays on your head you can run around with it and uh, i don't know it's I well, think it's pretty great. And well, it's ultra light, like ultra, ultra light. And also it's brand new. So if oh, you right. if you bought someone a Crift uh, last year and you're like, mm, I haven't got anything, mm. this hasn't come out last year. So it's guaranteed to be new for the climber you're buying it for. But the nice thing about it is that like all the pro climbers now are using it. Like have you seen that? Like Emily Arrington, yeah, like Daniel yeah, yeah. Woods, you're, they all have this head torch. So, you know, you're like part of the pro group. There you go. Join the pro group uh, and get this head torch. My expert present is the Dragonfly 25 litre pack. Uh, now this is, you know what I'm like, I'm a backpack nut, right? See. So personally, if anyone gave me a backpack, uh, I would be 
pretty happy to receive that. 460 grams, so it's lightweight, can be stripped right down. Blue Ice is actually a company based in Chamonix. So they're a company of climbers making gear for climbers in one of the climbing capitals of Europe. So you know that equipment has got quality coming out with it. DWR finish, so it can shrug off water, and it's got a whole load of features. It's got side pockets for a water bottle. Uh, it's got ice axe attachment points, uh, internal pockets, uh, ice um, place for your skis, so you can put loads of stuff on and a really simple access system at the top, just roll down, cinch it up, and off you go. It's a cool looking backpack, uh, fairly reasonably priced as well, around about 63 euros. That's a good price. It's not bad. 25 litres <laughs> is probably day pack territory, but mm -hmm. I do think with clever packing, you could probably go out for a night out if you're smart with it, um, <laughs> if you pack, well, if you don't pack like me, babe, if you pack like, like you. Like, what, like me? Yeah, you're a better packer. <laughs> You, you just like neat. I just kind of get to a point when it's all lined up and I just throw stuff into the bag. So don't do that just, and it will fit. I was just gonna say nine kilos for one overnight. I'm not a good packer. But <laughs> maybe it like pushes you to be a good packer because you only got 25 liters. There you go. You have to be conservative on space. And that's also on discount at the moment, 30% off. So it's a good time to buy it. Nice. Before the last um, big blow the budget present, shall we mention the giveaway? Yes, go for it. Again. <laughs> okay, so the giveaway is 10 free tickets, 10 tickets, uh, to watch, 10. I'm just being your background here, I'm going to do it just for... To watch Valhalla, do a Valhalla, okay. And uh, the new Lynn Hill movie, Climb Free. <laughs> I've got a lot of things to do. You can watch it tomorrow, tomorrow night online, and uh, if you won't win the tickets, but if you want to for sure see the movies. There's a discount code below and a link to get those tickets for the movies down below. But tune in, stay tuned, stay tuned? That's not how you say it. Stay on- Keep watching. Keep watching. <laughs> keep watching to, to maybe win the giveaway. Oh yeah, what do you have to do for the giveaway? For the giveaway, and I don't think we, I think we're gonna have to comment after the, the video here, but right. comment below the video when this is finished about your root name. So mm. not in the live chat bit, because we can't find you again very easily. Beneath the video, uh, what root name would you give a root for your first ascent? The weirdest, funniest ones that make us laugh will probably win, uh, because this is no way fair. We're just gonna pick ones that make us smile. Yeah. That's the giveaway, check that out. Final, blow the budget. Because every now and again, right, you have to splurge a bit. It's Christmas. Christmas is a time of splurging, and if you want to splurge, I'm using the word splurge a lot here. Yeah. The Atom LT hoodie from Arcteryx is a splurge-worthy present. 225 euros, it ain't cheap, but it is discounted at the moment down from 250, so a good time to buy it. Yep. I own this jacket, it's mm. hanging up in my house, and I absolutely love it. The reason I absolutely love it is because it's a proper active jacket. Okay. Synthetic y, um, and it's got a uh, moisture resistant outer, it's got a tough outer, uh, it's got 3D body molding which means there's stretchy bits in the right place for it to be stretchy bits. Right. There's insulation in the right place. So they've taken a human body and they've designed a jacket around it. Does it have a hood? Yes, hoodie. Hood, uh, okay. which is storm compatible. One hand, whack it back. Mm -hmm. It's one of the, I don't think it's a deep winter jacket, but it's one of those jacket for sort of like early season winter or like if you're cold on a summer's day, because it's not down, it means it doesn't get soaking wet. So okay. it's a good belay jacket. Mm -hmm. and. I'll be honest with this, right? So we get sent out of clothes. They sent me this uh, jacket and I was like, eh, why do I ever need that? Honestly, this is what happened. And then I wore it and oh my God, I loved it. I loved it. I absolutely loved it. I loved it so much. We did a whole gear show and that gear show is linked in the article on the Epic TV shop. It looks at all the things we've been chatting about today. That's Bene. It. Do you want to show the colors though? Because that green doesn't yes. really convince me. Let me go through, let me go through. So we've got uh, the green, which doesn't convince Terry, don't know. The red, I think I'd go for the red if I was a, a buyer. The blue, which I, this is my this favorite. This is the nice dark and classy, blue. yeah. It is kind of, it's kind of like understated. Um, it just looks like a normal jacket. Yeah, and then. Which, no, it's a plus. That is out of stock apart from, no, it's that's out of stock. So you good. can't have that yeah. color anyway, mm. even if you wanted it. <laughs> so that's it guys. Uh, we covered um, indoor climbing. Yes below 50 euros and then intermediate and expert climber of presence. Yeah, so that covers everything. That pretty much covers all categories, doesn't it? I reckon. Ish. Ish, yeah. Um, so if you do want ideas, that's our selection and everything we've chatted today is in the article. But if you think we're talking a load of rubbish and you want more options, 
go onto the Epic TV shop and at the top of the page there's a banner and that banner has links to a whole load of products in the same categories and in fact you don't even need to do that you can just go down below the episode and it's all linked in the categories so we've made it super super easy for you hopefully uh, to buy the perfect Christmas present Right, uh, for the people who are just tuning in, well, go back and watch the whole episode, <laughs> but <laughs> there is a giveaway, and the giveaway is 10 free tickets to watch Valhalla and the new Lynn Hill movie. So comment down below, not in the live chat, but in the comments down below, the name you would give to your own root or boulder, uh, and the name that's gonna make us laugh the most, well, just, we're, it's gonna win. So yeah, it's in no way fair. There we go. No cool. Fair. William, give us a few shout outs. Oh, shout outs. Okay, go. Uh, Vince W. Uh, Vince W. Yep. Uh, congratulations on your first ascent, that one. Oh, in yeah. what first ascent? I, I think it's about your first ascent, yeah, the Nutella one. Oh, oh, thanks. Well, I mean, I'll let you know when it will actually happen. <laughs> Mr. Mr. JK from Michigan. Uh, JK from Michigan, sup? Hello. Hello. Um, uh, who else? We've got Ross Potts, who's a big fan of Lynn Hill. Uh, Riley C is asking us about a 10 and 45 litre pack. Uh, are you talking about the Crag pack, Mr. Yeah. Ross? Riley? The one, oh, the one you have. The one I have, yeah, that I, I do really love. I don't think we actually sell it on the shop anymore, but it is a fantastic bag. There's a nice, well, it's not a 10 one, but there's a camp one that has the zipper down the back. Mm -hmm. That's a pretty nice backpack for like a Crag bag. Yeah, I would agree with you Just, on that one. Uh, long term subscriber, Richard Wright. Richard Wright. Hello, Richard Wright. Hello. How long is long-term subscriber, Richard Wright? How long have you been around like, for? Years. Years. Uh, any good? Uh, I'm just joining climbing these easy. comments. Sorry? Climbing easy. Climbing easy. Climbing Shout ain't out to climbing easy. easy. He's making a video. Tell him to send it to us. Uh, climbing easy. Climb at epictv.com. Drop us an email on that. We'll be able to check your movie out, give you some feedback maybe, perhaps share it. We'll see what happens. And that goes for anyone who's got a climbing movie. Climb at epictv.com. Send us a message. Any more uh, thank questions? Thank you, Andy. He says oh. he loves us and Andy. he's happy oh. when we go live. Oh, hi, Andy. What's up? Uh, that's Anything it. else? That's pretty much it. Hello. Merry Christmas to all of you in 14 days. Yes. <laughs> we will be back next week. Um, yeah, we'll be back <laughs> next week. And remember, last shout out, comment beneath the video with your root names. The top 10 will win those free tickets. Uh, you've probably got a couple of minutes after the show. We won't look at it for maybe half an hour. Mm -hmm. After that, we will be giving those tickets away. So get in quick. The funniest root names will win that prize. Cool. Hopefully that's giving you guys some ideas for Christmas presents. Uh, happy shopping, everyone. Go on to the Epic TV shop. All the links are down below. Have you picked your presents? I've expected, I picked the one I'm expecting you to buy me. Which is? No, you not that one. the budget <laughs> red jacket. You already have it. Yeah, but I want another oh. one in red. I've only got it in green, and I prefer it's, a red version. That's out of stock. I'll oh. get you the blue one, though. Fine, thank you. What, what, what will you... I? No, wait, I'm not getting it. What would you like from the uh, under 50 category? Nah, that's what? not fair. It's a, it's a lot of money. Top um, trump, font top trumps? A Nerona jacket, please. That's not under 50 euros. Yeah, but you're expecting a 200 euro present. They're fine. We'll argue about this later on. Cheers, guys. Happy Christmas, everyone. Lovely to see you, and we will see you next week. We'll be back. See you later. Bye-bye. Oh, we're still live. Let's do a dance uh, while we... <laughs>